You ready to go? Yeah. You sure? <coughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I should probably like put my toilet seat in the freezer tonight. <sighs> <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Pears Perfect. Today we are doing a hot sauce challenge slash taste test. We got five hot sauces, lightest to spiciest. We obviously have some Calidad beer to pair it with. And uh, we'll see how we do. I know I'm gonna do all right, Chris. How are you gonna do? I'm hoping not to throw up. I think, he, I, I think he's gonna have to run somewhere. <laughs> Over the years, I've kind of tried to build up my tolerance for spice, but uh, in the pantheon of uh, heat levels, I am I'm a welterweight. Okay. You ready to get started? I am. First hot sauce, the least spiciest of the five, one that we all know, almost in every household, every restaurant. Should be. Outside of Tabasco, <laughs> probably the most known hot sauce in uh, the U.S. is Cholula. Yeah, I love I mean, it. We all know this. Uh, you love it. Yeah, I, so I do. We, it's, I put this on my eggs. I, I really do. So we got these chips. Yeah. We'll, we'll get we'll get a little generous at the beginning. Make yeah, sure yeah. that he gets a flavor, a good flavor profile. He's going easy on me here. I know pandering when I see it. We both like it. We both can handle it. Yeah. Good flavor. Can't go wrong. Little known fact. Beer and milk are the only two things that bring down heat levels. Water doesn't do it. Soda, whatever else you want to go, doesn't do it. Beer, beer and milk are the only things. Next spice level. Numero dos. We got roasted habanero hot sauce. Mago, spicy magic. Good flavor. Never had this hot sauce before and it's pretty good. Mago sauce, pretty good. I'll definitely buy it. All right. We're gonna start getting into the good stuff now. Arizona peppers, organic harvest foods, organic habanero pepper sauce. I have had this before. It's got a good kick to it. Definitely more than the first two we had. And it's gluten-free. It's gluten-free, it's organic. This sauce is actually really good for you. Hot sauce has been proven that it helps with so many things. Yeah, vitamin D and C so that many. peppers have mm -hmm. are great for your body. Yep. Good flavor, no salty. Kind of reminds me of Tabasco a little bit. Yeah, but more of a punch. This one would pair perfect with like a Mexican seafood, like an okay. chile or something yeah, like that. I could see that. I, I would see it with like a, like a carnitas, mm. like a little street taco. Yeah. The heat level is definitely big, more than the first two. Still not quite there for me though. I can still hang, but honestly, this is usually my ceiling, so I'm a little worried. Whew. Yeah, that one's building. Building. <sighs> I need another beer. Look at him go with the beers. I like it. Go ahead. I'm going to suck I'm on good. some ice. Mm. I just mm. need a little, like, little, uh... All right, I'm good. I'm good. I'm ready to go. You ready to go? Yeah. You sure? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I should probably, like, put my toilet seat in the freezer tonight. On to number four. Ghost pepper and blueberry. I think the blueberry is going to help me. Like it's gonna, it's the sweet, sweet can chill heat. Yeah, it can. So, um, oh, there oh. it is. It's a runny sauce, which is not my favorite thing. Sounds like my afternoon. <laughs> kind of lacks flavor. I think this is not as hot as the last one. No, no, it kind of lacks flavor. Like it's like, just goes right through you. I hope that's not true. It's building now. It is? This is what scares me about these things. It's like, yeah, the first one's like, yeah, I'm cool, I'm chill. And you're like, no, no. wait. It wants to be spicy, yeah. but then the blueberry and the flavors. Blueberry chills it down. It does, right? <sighs> <laughs> I love the blueberry chills it down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm doing fine. Yep. I'm doing fine. Yep. You're yeah. doing all right. I'm good. We're gonna go to the hottest one we could get our hands on today. Got a cool little Halloween costume going. <laughs> <laughs> the Reaper. Reaper. It sounds a lot hotter than it probably is. It's this is either, a great marketing sauce. It's either a lot of bark. And no bite. Or they've used the costume in court to defend themselves on what happens. It's a great finger Halloween costume. The Reaper. All right. I'm going to die. 
zero calories. You can eat it all day and not have to worry. You know, for me, being Mexican, I typically just go like this. And they go like that to see if it's spicy or not. Because yeah. the chip can, the salt and all this stuff right. can like mask some yeah. things. Yeah, so like, <laughs> you know, you pour it and then you go, let's do this. And then you hit it. And then you hit it. There you go. Cheers. I don't know. It tastes good off my uh, hand. Let's get some more in here. It's starting to kick up. got some kind of restrictor on this thing. No, don't go there. It's starting to kick up. I don't think so. All right, this one's got a kick to it. It's starting to go. Chris, you are in trouble. I'm fine. I know. It tastes fine right away. It's starting to go. I want some more. It's really good. All right. Yeah. I mean, you, I'm not going to leave you this behind. Was supposed I was, to be I was the, trying to warn you. Maybe it's like the white vinegar or something that is too spicy for you, but oh. Is this the hottest one we're doing? Mm-hmm. What's next? Really? Yeah. That's easy. It's no problem. I thought this was gonna be tough. The creeps. The Reaper creeps. Is that the like Creeper the... is a Reaper. The yeah. Reaper is a Creeper. Yeah, it's like those uh, Halloween movies. Oh, it's like in the back of my throat. Mm -hmm. ah, can't get rid of it. It's definitely sitting there. You want to eat a beer? <laughs> you went for like a full chip. I tried to warn you. <laughs> you ate too much of that. Let's get some more in here. This is the hottest one we've done. I'm like, I'm like leaking <laughs> fluid. Do what you gotta do, Chris. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, that helps. <sighs> I got like snot. <laughs> Look at that snot. <laughs> <laughs> My body doesn't like it. It does not like what I just put in it. <laughs> Oh my god, my nose is so runny right now. I need more <laughs> paper towels. Holy crap. Well, there's more here. You feel like a new man. Uh, it's spicy. It weirdly builds, mm -hmm. right? But it only gets so high. And it just stays at that high level. It never got so right. That's the problem. It's not going down. Mm -hmm. Like my teeth are on fire. It's really hot when it gets to its, its top level. It hasn't hit my hottest of hot buttons. Definitely agree. Underneath the hottest thing I've ever had, but still, you know, 10. Yeah. Top yeah. 10. Oh yeah, no, this is, yeah. This is in my top five hottest things that I've uh, ever witnessed. This would totally mess you up. I'll talk to you tomorrow on how I feel, I think that's gonna be the real danger in this one. Uh, I, don't think it's, I don't think it's one of those. I think it just sits there, and then when it goes away, it's done. put together. It's a good sauce. We build from Cholula up to this guy, the Reaper. We handled it. Chris did his best. He handled it. He's still here Reaper, with us. The Reaper, the Reaper. And, uh, Kelly, that beer got us through. Thank God for this beer <sighs> and really cold beer. Yes. I, I would be dead if I did not have beer. All right. Tell us what hot sauces you've had at home. Let us know what you have. If you, yeah, if you have one that you know that is spicier than this, I'm ready for the challenge. Yeah. I survived. You did drool. I did drool and then there was a <laughs> nose thing happening, but I want more. Yeah. I want spicier, I want hotter. Let I us need know. to know where where to go. He's, a, he's got a new spice level that uh, the bar has been raised. Hey guys, 
Hope you liked the episode. Turn on notifications, subscribe, like. See you next time.